what's up guys and welcome back to another Grill Attack fan game tutorial. Now, you guys voted this one. You voted how to add cosmetics to a Grill Attack fan game. So, today we're, I'm going to be showing you how to do that. Uh, it's pretty cool, I think, yeah, and it's super easy. Also, thank you so much for 28 subscribers. It means a ton to me. Go down to subscribe because these videos take a ton of time. Okay. So the first thing you want to do is open up Unity Hub and then open up your tu your game. Mine is obviously a tutorial game, so I'm just going to load that up and wait for that to load up. Okay, once you've loaded up your game, it should look like exactly how you left it. Obviously, we left it like this, with an M computer and everything. And now, let's say you want to add some cosmetics. So, a really cool thing about Photon is it actually has a preloaded cosmetic when you download the photon when you download the photon VR pack. You just gotta do you just gotta go to player and then in head cosmetics and VR top part and then when you see it's a bit big and the player model is a bit small so I'm gonna pre I'm just gonna scale up the player model. Turn on VR head and then obviously move the player model down and then I'm just gonna do this for a bit. I'll cut it out though. Okay, so basically this is VR top hat. I'm just gonna move it back here, scale it down a bit, obviously, because it's a bit big, and move this player name up. So obviously you can you can so obviously you can see the top hat, and as you can see, that's what it will look like. So we want to disable that, and here we we'll just do Control C, that will paste the name basically, and we have we want to go back to a scene. And let's make a new group. Let's name it Cosmetics. Okay. And then let's just give it a cube quick. The cube is right here as you can see. Let's just put the cube over here, okay? Let's make like a little stand for it. Move it up a bit. And also there's this really cool trick I learned. If we duplicate this, make a material and then we name this material. Let's name this material like glass. You don't. Have, you can name it whatever you want. You go to here, rendering mode transparent, and make this like that. You can actually make like a transparent material that you can see through. Obviously, um, what we're gonna do here is we're gonna give it. We're gonna go back to our resources, go to VR player, get our VR top hat. We're gonna. Copy this, go here, and paste it in. Where'd it go? There it is. So our VR top hat is right now right here, okay? So I'm gonna make this a bit bigger, obviously, so you guys can see what you're getting, okay? And now, I'm gonna drag that into there, obviously, so it's in all in one group. So now, what you wanna do is you wanna duplicate this, Control D, make it a bit smaller, and then just push it out. So, guys, I'm back now. All right, so you wanna pull this out, and then just make it a little bit shorter, and just move it to like about here. Now, give this the green material, okay? Now we're gonna control D and then give this a red material. Okay. Now we're gonna go to the awesome server of the developing hub. It's super cool. And credits to um Dojo the developer, his channel will be linked in the description for like letting me use the scripts. Uh this is gonna be a head cosmetic, so I'm only gonna download the head. But these are also, this is right hand, left hand, body, face. So yeah, I'm only going to download head for now. And I already have it downloaded. So I'm just going to go into Unity, import new asset. And as you can see here, it's change head cosmetic. Just click import on that. It's going to compile all the scripts, make them work basically. And then don't just... If just I can't speak. Put the
put the scripts into scripts. It should be an automatic folder in your thing, in your app, Unity. Just put them, put them into that to just like contain them, obviously, so they don't clutter your thing. Obviously, so here is change head cosmetic. All you wanted to do is just drag it onto the green and red. Now on the red, you see this. Just make, just keep that nothing, and on this. The thing that we pasted earlier, just put that in there. It has to be ex the exact same because I've, otherwise it won't work. So yeah, basically you've got cosmetics now. If let's go try it out. Obviously not in VR. As you can see, we've loaded in. There's our player model. And let's just say we want a top hat. I'll just click it. And boom, we've got a top hat. Pretty cool, right? And then it shows up in the mirror as well, obviously. That's how to add cosmetics to a game. Thanks for watching. Subscribe.